Ladies and gentlemen, my friends, welcome back to Pouring Whiskey. Today is Bourbon Battle Day. So, we thought a little bit about it. So, let's bring in that finished French Oak Penelope. And that wonderful Sagamore Double Oak Finishing American Oak Barrels. Let's get down to it. You know? So, what do y'all think here? We're going with the Penelope Architect. Build number seven. Latest bottle in the Penelope series for this. So, <clears throat> and then the second one. Double oak. Proofs are a little different. We'll talk about that. So we're on a 104 for the Penelope Architect. Number seven, 96.6. On the same or double oak. So, no joke, 62 bucks, 63 bucks. So, we're on here. We're going. So, class number one, we're going to do Sagamore. Let that sound like one song. Yeah. But we get a real cork. So, we're kind of happy about that. I mean, I'm really happy about that. So then, class number two, the Penelope. Mm, a little bit better, but synthetic. I'd rather have real cork. I don't know how you all feel about it, but I'd rather have the real stuff. I'm not much into the fake crap. So. Sagamore, Spirit, Double Eye, Penelope, Architect Build number seven. Let's mix them up. Let's see where we end up. It is Friday. Hope you all had a good week. Enjoy the weekend. Clean, clean. All right. What do you think? Glass on the left. Let's see it. Mm. Mm hmm. A lot of vanilla, citrus. I do like that a lot. Mm hmm. A little bit on the flavor lines. We enjoy to see them too. Class on the right. Flavor lines also. Very nice. Hmm. A lot more oaky, caramel. -y. Mm hmm. A toffee in there too. Hmm. I enjoy that. Hmm. It's going to be a good battle, my friends. Probably my two favorite distilleries. <clears throat> yeah, I would, I would think so. So. Hmm. And in all honesty, they both came from MGP. So that's pretty cool, too. So they've actually been distilled. So I guess I can say my favorite distilleries, my favorite uh, <clears throat> bourbon companies. We'll go with that because they don't distill it just yet. But they both bought their, you know, their liquid, their starter from MGP. They aged it the way they wanted to, and then they aged it the way they wanted to, and then they both finished it. So that's really nice. Let's get into the tongue, my friends. That's the best part. Hmm. Mm -hmm. I vanilla, that citrus comes right through. Right through. That is superb. Really nice. Sits with you just a little bit. Very little. 
There's a little bit of lingering in there. Mm hmm. A little vanilla, too, right there on the back end. Just starts to hit you. It's enjoyable. Glass on the right. That oak and toffee comes right through. Mm. That is very tasty. Very tasty. Mm. What do we do? We gotta choose. Right to left. Maybe it'll help. Sit with me. Mm. Nose wise, glass on the right, my friends. Mm -hmm. I like the toffee that comes through there. The oakiness, I think, is a little bit more pungent. I don't like that. It's left glass. It's there, but the citrus is overpowering, I think, to the oak with that vanilla. Mm hmm. I like this nose on the red glass a little bit more. <clears throat> Let's to the tongue. That sits with you a little bit longer too. That oak, <clears throat> it hits you. You really feel it. It's very enjoyable. Very enjoyable. Mm. The oak makes the bourbon. So, well, ages it makes it taste really good. It's a little bit more subtle on the oak. Not as much. Mm -hmm. With this left glass, you get more flavors. Your citrus, your vanilla. You get a little oak. It's there. Over on this side, you get your oak, you get a little vanilla, it's there. But that toffee, that toffee coats your mouth, your tongue, while it goes down. And it really sits with you, it's a lingerer. I like that, lingerer. <clears throat> My friends, today, the winner is the glass on the right. Yeah. I would say so. We'll go back, but I don't know. Hmm. Yeah. Today's winner's glass on the right. More pungent. There's more flavor, I think to the actual, actual bourbon of what it is. This left glass, there, there's other aromas, things that are, you know, with they're both being finished. So, I think this has more of the original bourbon in it. This is nice, but what's the winner? Number one, look at that. That is Mr. Sagamore Spirit Double Oak. So, we're not going to talk bad about Penelope because Penelope is amazing. You know, get their little French oak staves. Maybe the, the oak on that, that side of the world is a little bit different. Obviously, it would be because it's grown differently. Temperatures are grown 
temperatures don't grow. Temperatures are different. And, you know, climates and everything, the trees like to grow. So the oak would be different. That's a damn good battle, my friends. Both MGP, both finished in an oak barrel that was different. I would, I'm going to say, American Oak does it today. Oh yeah, that American Oak took out the French Oak on this Friday. So, hey, we'll see y'all next time. Like the video, subscribe, hit the buttons. You know what to do. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna enjoy the rest of these.